Stand Up Saturdays, people. Netflix has got so many fantastic stand up comedy specials. I figured, hey, once a week I can give you a recommendation and I will never run out. But I'm kicking it off with an unconventional one that is so just special and near to my heart. It is called Nanette. <laughs> comfortable in a small town I get a bit tense mainly because I'm in this situation it's by Hannah Gadsby who's Australian and an amazing stand-up comic if you ask me and in a small town that's all right from a distance people are like oh good bloke but this particular production it's not just a special it's more special than a special it manages to be not her doing stand-up at the same time as it is clearly her on a stage with a microphone, the, the setup for stand-up comedy. I love being mistaken for a man. I, I wouldn't want to be a straight white man. Not if you paid me. Although the pay would be substantially better. <laughs> she story tells in a way that would not be recommended usually for a stand-up comedian. But it's because she has a higher purpose with this production and her bearing her soul, laying down what it means to be who she is, the decisions that she's made for how she's gonna shape the rest of her career, for how she views stand-up comedy itself. I do think I have to quit comedy though. And it's probably not the forum to make such an announcement, is it? <laughs> I have built a career out of self-deprecating humour and I simply will not do that anymore, not to myself or anybody who identifies with me. It culminates in this amazing experience watching Nanette where you definitely laugh, but yo, I cried. <laughs> I cried several times. Uh, there are some of you watching this out there going, seriously? You want me to watch a, a comedy special and I'll go cry? Do it. Please, please do it. Please. I am begging you. Especially those out there who have pigeonholed themselves into um, like shock comedy and like people who are funny just because they're seeing something outrageous. Do you understand what self deprecation means? It's not humility, it's humiliation. Please try to take in somebody who is being really funny because what she is saying is so, so deeply true. I want my story heard because what I would have done to have heard a story like mine 